Man, this is the deadest police department I've ever seen. Are they closed? Yeah. Notice you guys have a really big police station here. Yeah, we do. Why do you guys need so much room? Uh, it's a big city, so we do need it. Uh, yeah, where's all the, why don't you guys have the desk full? There's no crime here, huh? We're low staffed. You're low staffed? Yeah. You guys are hiring or what? Uh, you want to come join our team? Oh, yeah. Hi, SantaAnnaPD.org. All right, thank you. Low staffed. Santa Ana's low staffed, he said. Can I help you with anything? No, thank you. You can go back to work. Okay. Actually, my question is this. You're on the private property, so what is it that you're doing? This is not you? private property. You better fuck off, dude. Okay. You better fuck off. Okay, do you have a reason to be here? Yeah, I we're, do. We're conduct, we are conducting my business. My own reason. It's my own we're reason, and you don't have business. to know. If you do not have any uh, business It doesn't here. have anything to do with you, and you can go away. Well, actually, it does. This is no, it doesn't. Apartment. This is not private property. It's owned by the public, so fuck off, dude. Okay, well, guess fuck what? Fuck off. You, we are fuck off. on... Fuck off. Okay. Are you, are you trying to be like... No, I want you to go away and leave me alone. You're the one that's trying to cause something, so go away. No, actually, go away. My cousins. I'm going to stay here as long as I want. Okay, well, me too. Okay. Yep. We're on the same page now. All right. Fucking coward. Tom, I called you a coward too, so they could hurry up. Okay. 
So you why would you walk up to me and cause a disturbance, first well, of all? Because the staff here was complaining. Uh, the the, the but her feelings doesn't trump the Constitution. Okay. But her feelings don't trump the Constitution. Okay. And, w and which part of the Constitution is that? The First Amendment. Which is? The freedom speech, of press. The press freedom of press and the, the freedom press? of speech. Are you the press? Because most press It doesn't matter. You inferior. know you know what the freedom of press is for? The freedom of press is for the people that don't work for the media. That means that I can hold a camera and record anything I can see in public. Yeah. And there's nothing you can do to stop me. And this building is owned by the public. It's taxpayer owned. Mm -hmm. It's not private. So you better learn your job a little bit okay. better. You want to wear that badge? You, you want to enforce the law? You better wear that badge with honor. Question. Let me ask you a question. No. If it's owned by the public, then why is there hours at opening and closing? Yeah, because, because it's a business. That's why. It's a exactly. business. And after hours, I can't be here. Mm -hmm. But while you're open for business, I could yeah. be here all I want. If you have no reason to be here, then you don't need to be here. I have a you reason. Have I have what a reason, that and reason? that's none of your business. I don't have to explain reason? anything to the you. The only reason that this You lobby, and your smug attitude, lobby? I don't have to explain shit to you, okay, dude. The lobby, the only purpose of this lobby. I don't give a shit what you're going to explain to me. Okay. I don't care. I don't the care. Your mumbo lobby. jumbo don't mean shit, dude. You, you, you could do this all day long, and I don't care. The lobby is I don't care. I don't care what you're saying. I really don't care what you're saying. Look at this crap, dude. Yeah, we're busy. Come on, we got things to do. Here. Yeah, go away. Go the fuck on, dude. Go away. I didn't call you over here. I'm not disturbing anybody. You're the one that caused a disturbance walking up to me. Get this on your camera. You caused a disturbance walking up to me. Get this on your camera right now, okay? I'm advising you. If you have no lawful business here, yeah, with the, I have the, the business. Police department, it's none of your business. The okay? fuck off. I'm gonna tell then you again. You will be I'm gonna tell you again. Go ahead. Charge me for trespassing. trespassing. Go ahead. That? Arrest me right now. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Do you Let's have go. a reason to be Let's here go. other than this? Let's go. Let's go. Arrest me. Go ahead. So I'm going to remove this camera so, no, you're it not. Get, so it doesn't get damaged, okay? I don't give consent to search. I don't give consent to search, dude. Well, I'm not asking for your consent. Yep. You guys are fucked. I want to talk to my lawyer right now. Find out. Bitch. You guys are fucking trash. That's what you are, it's fucking trash. Trash has fucking police, dude. Put me under arrest for doing that my information as well. Hey, gentlemen, I'll take it from here if you guys Thank are you. take off. Thank you. You guys can all take off. I got all their name and badge numbers. Right, I was just Thank illegally detained by the Anaheim, the Santa Ana Police Department. I was just illegally detained, handcuffed for 30 minutes. Look at the wrist, my wrist. handcuffed, searched against my will. Okay, I need somebody to help me out. Are you I the one that's going to help me? To register. Yes. Would you like a complaint form? I'll be glad to get you one. I need everybody's name and badge number, sir. You want a complaint form? I do. I do. Okay, I'll take care of that. All right. So, like I said, guys, I came into the uh, police department. I was just filming here. Um, being very cordial to everybody. I didn't really speak to anyone ex except for one person behind the counter and uh, They decided to call for backup and about Six or eight officers came out surrounded me and When he threatened with me with arrest I told him to go ahead and put it put the cuffs on and he grabbed me quick He was real quick to put them on I Extended my hands out. I said you're gonna put me under arrest. Go ahead you know, and it's on him. It's definitely on him, the tyranny is real. Santa Ana police is gonna learn the hard way. Like this is where all the, all the uh, detectives are up here, eavesdropping over the hedge. They're about to learn a valuable lesson, guys. Hit the like button, guys, if you guys are with me. Hit the like button. That's how it is, guys. Detained, cuffed. Look at this crap. Look at this. It's fucking crazy. Thank you for the donations, guys. Thank you, Juan. I appreciate it.
So now, now there's nobody behind the counters. And look, my bag is still over there, full of my stuff. So this is what they do, guys. They want to they wanna try to get us to cause a problem. I asked him what I was under arrest for. He said trespassing. He said if I didn't have um, official business here that I was going to be placed under arrest. And I told him, well, you better place me under arrest then because I do have official business. And if you're going to arrest me, it's going to be for your butthurt feelings. And that's exactly what he did. That's exactly what he did. So that's how it goes down, guys. Six to eight officers surrounding me. About three or four of them put their hands on me. And, uh, and then I had about three or four supervisors just standing around supervising me so I didn't run off with cuffs behind my back. And the guy still had the nerve to hold on to my arm while I was standing there in cuffs. <laughs> no, I didn't have my ID on me. I didn't ID. They, uh, once they released me out of cuffs and I told them I was going to make a complaint, I gave the I gave the sergeant my first and last name and phone number. Yeah, they, they were butthurt today, guys. They were super butthurt because I guarantee you nobody's ever talked to them like that before. I told them to fuck off. I told them to get out of my face. I told them to fuck off. I told them to stop causing a disturbance. I told them he walked up to me and now he was causing a disturbance. They all took off, man. Look, there's nobody back here now. Before they were under staff, but now they have no staff. And the sergeant came and called the two girls to the back. I don't know if he's going to educate them on, on ratting people out for filming in the lobby or what, but he should. He should definitely educate everybody, and this should be a learning lesson for everybody in this department at this point. What's up, my little... And this place, in, this place has millions of dollars put into it. This is the taxpayer's money. This is how many people's rights they violated. They have violated so many people's rights, put them through the system, made them pay thousands, hundreds of thousands of dollars. And this is the thanks that we give to them. We give them this beautiful station. And then they wanna, they wanna harass us and treat us like criminals after we gave them this place somewhere comfortable to sit all day and, and do work.